Okay, so this is um, the Batman Sanity uh, statue, and I got a creaky chair. Um, so we'll ignore that for a moment. Uh, so it's 3D printed by myself. Um, you can find files from various places online, uh, different prices all over the place, or you can go to um, eBay or a um, Chinese competitor and you can buy the kit to assemble yourself which would cost you about £300 roughly. Uh, this is done in one tenth scale as you can see uh, I've printed it in flesh I've putted it using mini putt super fine it's in white and uh, sanded it and yeah, it's all nice up there at the moment. Um, however, right in the back, when we had some issues, uh, this is not so much an issue. Um, basically, the, the lines at the top didn't match up to the lines at the bottom, so I sanded them away. And I have got some plastic strip, which I will be putting on there later. Um, a bit of sanding going on there. Let's move that over. They really look good. Um, and that's the putty. That's where we're at at the moment. Lots of putty, not sanded. And uh, yeah, that's that. As I said it's one done in one temp scale. Scale uh, at forty five percent. If you do it at one hundred percent scale. You're looking at a one quarter scale figures and all my figures are in that box yeah so what kind of detail are we going to look at well what we got we got penguin so if we take a look at penguin just randomly and take out a piece there is a hand Printed at 0.05 millimeter layers. And that's the body. And that's the kind of quality we've got. We've got two second, two seconds uh, exposure time. 60% UV power. And it's coming out pretty good. Um, Face is there is face looks like like that. Okay, so that's penguin. Can okay, you set that back up? That's a new environment to build in there. I've got purpose built desk computer where I can download my files, sort them out on the shitty box and away you go. I have my paint station there. Uh, what else have we got in the box? I'm trying to find a good one. Joker. Okay. This one's Joker. As it says on the back. I'm going to get him. Eventually, Joker. There he is. He looks a bit like that. Try and get it better. Looks like that. So it's pretty cool. As I said, 0.05 millimeter of the layer. So 10 layers is half a mil. I can't remember what the um, anti-aliasing is, but it varies. Um, I've got a Mono X and some say it does work and it doesn't work. So that's that. Now this is a big piece. This is clay face. And 
the the body looks like that. It's all hollow. And little dimples of where the supports have been. Sun moth, and it should fit nicely, and that will go up there somewhere. Like that. Okay. Let's just pack that one back. Now, let me zip this up. I'll put you there. Got me a minute. I'll be a minute. Okay, I'll cut that out. So, this is Batman. Right, here we go. This is Batman. And Batman looks like... As Batman should. Is this it? said one tenth scale and it's come out well and not only do I have one but I have two the reason why I have two is that I'm doing one in the classic blue and grey and one in the Arkham dark grey and black colors so that's that so this is update 2.5 there was a 2 but my phone broke and I lost the video and that's that but if you want to follow me subscribe like do whatever you want comment any information I can give I will give and uh, follow my progress from here cheers guys